this next example of a time problem gets a little more complicated because your infusion is not calculated in milliliters per hour, but rather in drops per minute. At 0800 hours, an IV infusing at 25 drops per minute through 15 drop per milliliter tubing with 350 milliliters remaining, when will the next bag be needed? You'll notice in the toolbox I have the time, flow rate, the tubing used, and the volume in the bag when the bag was checked. The first thing that has to be done in order to calculate this problem is the flow rate and tubing used need to be combined in order to figure out the milliliters per hour. So 25 drops per minute is multiplied by 4 to establish the flow rate at 100 milliliters per hour. Now that we have that, if 100 milliliters is in in one hour, how long will it take for 350 milliliters to infuse? It's easy enough to know that 3.5 is the answer. However, 0.5 does not represent minutes. 0.5 multiplied by 60 equals 30 minutes. If the total runtime is 3 hours and 30 minutes, this then must be added in the last step to the time this was verified. According to this, the next bag will be needed at 11.30 a.m. or 11.30 hours.